I really love Chinese yeah. character because she's not a love interest at all. She's almost Paul's anchor. Yeah. But resents him because he is a part of this bigger prophecy that she doesn't quite believe. Mm -hmm. How fun was that? Yeah. No. I I think uh, what I what I appreciate that Denny found within within this story is is allowing Chani to have a very very mm -hmm. strong perspective um, and heart uh, that ultimately makes her very distrusting of Paul and mm -hmm. what he represents. And so um, as an actress, it gave me something to really to play into because now you're not just falling in love and everything is, you know, happy and sunshine and rainbows. You know, it's it's honestly a it's a battle, I think, inside of her to allow herself to love uh, someone like this. Um, and it makes it more complicated mm. and, and, and the weight is, is bigger when she does open up herself to him. With Princess Irulan, I love the fact that you got so much more than what was in the pages of the book. How was that expanding her role? Did you kind of lean into Denny's vision of it or did you read the book and you're like, I can see where I can go with this character? Um, both, I think, you know, it's it's always wonderful when there's a when there is um, a book behind a script because you can pick out what you want to bring with you, what you want to what you want to leave behind. Um, I think something that I really appreciate appreciated about the script was was you really watch this woman grow in every scene that she's in, and you really get to understand that she is constantly um, on the edge of 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 figuring out the thing that she that has been kept from her. Um, and then also, you know, you always have to trust your director and you have to trust that they're going to lead you in all the right places. And Denis is just a fantastic person to work um, underneath, beside, like he truly, uh, he, he, he feels very safe as a director. Um, and I think coming into this world as any actor, it's so large, the, the characters are so large, the sets are so large, the world is so large. It's very wonderful having a director that anything you throw down, he's there to shape with you. Um, and especially, you know, there being the first movie that did so well and, and, and really just like got everybody buzzed about what was gonna come next. It's, it's very intimidating walking onto a set like that. So I really appreciated that what I had picked up from book and from script was allowed and, and um, you know, there's a, there's a dot, 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 which is a wonderful thing as an actor to feel that it doesn't end here, it's gonna keep growing. What I, what I love about this is that uh, Denny basically lured you into part one, saying, part two, you're going to take off. You know, finish you in part one, but part two is where it's at. And then you had the same thing. <laughs> the same Come in in part two, <laughs> yeah. we'll introduce you. But you know, it's funny <laughs> you say, like, Denny didn't have to convince me. I was the one. Like, when I first heard <laughs> that he was making this, and I heard, I watched the this version, <laughs> and I was like, oh, that's the character they're trying to cast. Okay, wait a minute. Hey, hey, I know you don't know me, and I know you're not even casting this yet, because it was before they even started wow. doing auditions or anything, but I was like, just well wanna done. Put my go. put my name out there, you know, and they well were like, done. oh, we'll wait till we start auditioning people and everything, and I, and I auditioned and did my chemistry read, and nice. Yeah. Sealed the deal. Sealed well the deal. <laughs> You've got Jessica, his mother, who's, you know, lifting him up and course correcting a lot of the time. And then Shani, who's making sure that he's not blowing up and keeps him grounded. And then Irulan, dot, dot, dot. We have to get a part three, yes? But the thing is that uh, uh, Florence Pugh came on board with the same promise that I did to Zendaya when it, she, Zendaya did part one. I said, uh, uh, you will be, uh, it will just be an introduction to your character and if there's a second part, then your character will be absolutely a prominent uh, 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 well, at the epicenter of the story. Uh, uh, it's a bit of the same thing with Florence. It's, we introduce her character in part two and if there's a Dune Messiah adaptation, then she becomes one of the main, uh, it's like how, so. When, not if. How bad do we need a part three? <laughs> We're here, yeah, like, yeah. like desperate for one. Oh, I um, want to know what happens, you know? I think yeah. it leaves on such a I note. I want to see those this. two have a... a the f I want to I wanna be a fly on the wall when they, for the first conversation. Yes, me too. I want to oh be there. Oh my God.